All right, guys. UFC on FX returns. May, this is May 18th. Is this card? Yep, May 18th. Use, and it's going to be Vitor Belfort versus Luke Rockhold. After that last month we had, this month seems to be... <sighs> and I wonder why. Was he trying to stay away from this past weekend with the Kentucky Derby and all that? Who? UFC. I, you know, I mean... I, there, last I mean, month we had an event every single weekend. Yeah, and I think this week, I mean, obviously, I think... You're, the end of the regular NBA season was was winding down, so it wasn't you know the the placings and the seedings for the playoffs were going to start. You know, I think now, you know, and March Madness was over, so April was a good time to stick things in. Playoff basketball, NBA playoff basketball is strong in May. It's hard to go up against that shit, you know, um, especially when the series are narrowing down and you have big games on Saturday nights. So, so we only have two UFC events in May. This yeah, one this is in one UFC one hundred and sixty. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> but uh, this is Vitor Belfort versus Luke Rockhold. But uh, I know, man, I got to a little bit. Oh yeah, it was like that. Anyway, uh, it will be Luke Rockhold's first fight in the UFC, and he has looked really fucking good in in, in Strike Force mm -hmm. when Strike Force before it just sank like the motherfucking Titanic. Mm -hmm. um, but the first fight of the night that's going to be on the card? Yes. It's going to be middleweight. It's going to be middleweight. Right. See, George, this is... Let me tell this you something is where about George me. gets real he, fucking quiet. He, he turns into a mute because that's when he's like, Kevin, I don't know how to pronounce these motherfuckers' names. I'm going to tell you how it's going to go down. If I get it wrong, okay. Rafael Natal versus Oejo Zaffarino. Yes, yeah, son. Two middleweights, okay? Um, Natal is great at submissions. Great, 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 obviously, because he's got mad BJJ skills. And But he has been floored a couple times, George. He's been knocked out. Now, I would love to talk to you people about his opponent, but that motherfucker is the invisible man. I, he doesn't even have a Wikipedia page, and I'm going to tell you right now, that is my past. When you don't have a Wikipedia page as a fighter, don't expect me to talk about you. You MMA enthusiasts can say all the fucking shit in the world about you're not a real... F I don't give a fuck, because do if you guys know anything about Oejo Zaffarino, please fucking send it in my inbox, because I don't know shit about him. I'm By sorry. By inbox, he means his ass. See, man? Well, this That's motherfucker's code. got the Miami Heat dick right to his fucking chin. It's unfortunate because we just got done it's talking. It's just unfortunate. It's unfortunate because we just got done talking basketball and we didn't say anything about the Lakers. Why is that? Get that heat dick away from my face. Oh, anyway. wait, because they're home. No. Comical, brash, and yeah, sometimes politically incorrect. The Uncut Sports Show. Non traditional sports coverage delivered the way you like it by your uncensored co hosts, Kevin White and George Bedford.